Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, we will uh, derive the recurrence formulas for Legendre polynomial. Earlier, I had derived it for recurrence formula one. Now, we will derive the recurrence formula two. So, we will start from the generating function, which is given by one minus two x z plus z square raised to power minus one by two is equal to summation n z raised to power n p n x. Now, we will differentiate this equation. We will consider it as equation number one, and we will differentiate it. Uh, with respect to z, we know that the differentiation of x raised to power n is given by n x raised to power n minus one. So if we will put n equal to minus one by two, then we will get minus one one upon two x raised to power minus one upon two minus one. And we have applied this thing in this term also. We have differentiated this term with respect to z, and we will get minus one by two one minus two x z plus z square raised to power minus three by two. And since we have differentiated it with uh, with respect to z, so we will differentiate this part again, and we will get minus two x plus two z. Similarly, in on uh, on the right hand side we will get summation n differentiation uh, differentiation of z raised per n will be n z raised per n minus 1 p n x now uh, this 2 will come outside of this uh, bracket and this 1 upon 2 and this 2 will get cancelled out so we will uh, get the term x minus z 1 minus 2 x z plus z square raised to power minus 3 by 2 and this uh, term will remain as it is uh, let us consider that this equation is equation number two. Now we will differentiate equation number one with respect to x. So we will get this term um, minus one upon two, one minus two x z plus z square raised to power minus three by two. And with respect to x, so we will get minus two z and it will be equal to summation n z raised to power n and summation uh, differentiation of p n x will be d p n x upon d of x. So here 2 and 2 will get cancelled out and this minus minus will also get cancelled out. So we will get the term z 1 minus 2x z plus z square raised to power minus 3 by 2 and this RHS will remain as it is. Now consider this equation as equation number 3. Now di divide equation number 2 uh, by the equation number 3. So what we will get? We will get this term. Now this 1 minus 2xz upon z square raised to power minus 3 by 2 will get cancelled out so we will get the term x minus z upon z on lhs and here uh, that the, the whole term will remain as it is so what we will do now we will cross multiply these terms so we will get x minus z this term will get multiplied on with x minus z and this z will get multiplied with uh, this numerator so we will get the term x minus z summation n z raised to power n d p n x upon dx and on this uh, right hand side we will get uh, summation n n z z raised to power n minus 1 p n x so we can write this z z dot z raised to power n minus 1 will become z raised to power n minus 1 plus 1 since uh, this the power of this z is 1 so we will get z raised to power n on uh, left hand uh, right hand side so now we will multiply this term in this bracket also so we will get summation summation n x raised uh, x z raised per n d p n x upon d x minus summation n this is z so z into z raised per n d p n x upon d x and the uh, right hand si side will remain as it is so now uh, we are left with the term since it is z z raised per 1 and z raised to power n so it will get z raised to power n plus 1 and uh, the the uh, other things will remain as it is now we will compare the coefficients of z raised to power n on both sides on right hand side and on left hand side H here we have z raised to power n so it will be very easy to uh, compare the coefficient of z raised to power n on the, uh, in uh, uh, for this term we will get the co uh, coefficient of z raised to power n in this term as x d p n x upon dx this term this will be the coefficient of z raised to power n but in this term we have z raised to power n plus 1 but we uh, want to co uh, compare the coefficient of z raised to power n so to make the uh, uh, coefficient of z raised to power n what we will do we will put n equal to n minus 1 so that this z raised to power n plus 1 will become z raised to power n minus 1 
plus 1 on putting the value of n equal to n minus 1 we will get this minus uh, and uh, minus 1 and plus 1 will get cancelled out so we will get z raised to power n similarly in this pn we will put uh, n equal to n minus 1 we will get dpn minus 1 upon dx and uh, on this right hand side we have z raised to power n so its coefficient will be n pn uh, pn x now uh, or this above equation can be written in this uh, this form we have written n p n equal to x d p n upon d x minus d p n minus 1 upon d x this is the recurrence formula number 2 for the Legendre polynomial now we will derive the uh, recurrence formula uh, uh, 3 for the Legendre polynomial which is given by p n plus 1 dash minus p n minus 1 dash equal to 2 n plus 1 p n x for this we will consider the recurrence formula, uh, recurrence formula of Legendre polynomial number one, which is given by this equation. Now, in this equation, we will put n equal to n plus one. So, what we will get uh, here in this in this term, we will uh, put n equal to one. Uh, everywhere we will we will put n equal to n plus one. So, we will get n plus one p n plus one. Here also we will put 2 into n plus 1 minus 1. It will become 2n plus 2 minus 1 which will become 2n plus 1. x pn here uh, in pn minus 1 if we will put pn plus 1 minus 1 it will become pn. And here also n plus 1 n plus 1 minus 1 then we will get n. And here it is n minus 2. So in place of n if we will put n plus 1 then we will get n minus 1 which is written here. Now we, uh, we will differentiate this equation with respect to x and we will get this term. Here we will apply uv rule and uh, this term will become this is pn plus 1 so it will become p dash n plus 1. Here we will uh, apply uv rule so we will get this term. Now uh, we know that recurrence formula 2 is given by x p n dash is equal to n p n plus p n minus 1. As we know that recurrence formula 2 is given by n p n equal to x d p n upon d x minus d p n minus 1. We have taken this term on this side and we have uh, arranged the terms and we have written this. Uh, this d p n upon d x is p n dash and d p n minus 1 upon d x is p n minus 1 dash. Now we will put this x pn dash this x pn dash the value of x pn dash uh, we will put this value in uh, this place so we will get this term and now further on solving further we will get n plus 1 pn plus 1 dash is equal to 2n plus 1 pn will remain as it is now uh, we will multiply this 2n plus 1 in this bracket and we will get this term now here uh, what we will do we will take pn term together here we have pn here also we have pn pn if we if we will take pn from these two terms outside what we will get pn 2n plus 1 plus n 2n plus 1 now here we have 2n plus 1 2n plus 1 so we can take this 2n plus 1 outside so we will get 2n plus 1 1 plus n so we have written this term here and we have taken this pn minus 1 dash and n pn minus 1 uh, in this side so we will get n plus 1 pn plus 1 dash minus n plus 1 pn minus 1 dash here here also we have pn minus 1 dash pn minus 1 dash we we can take uh, pn minus 1 dash as common we will get 2n plus 1 minus n which will become n plus 1 so uh, now at last we will divide this whole term by n plus 1 so we will get this equation which is the recurrence formula number 3 i hope you understood uh, the whole concept of recurrence formula number 1 2 and 3 if you liked my video then please share it and subscribe my channel thank you